Are you really telling me that you've moved on with this Jared guy? I'm trying to, yes. What about us? Why don't you tell me, Ethan? Oh, considering what happened the other night, I thought that... What? I thought that I was giving you what you wanted. And that we were maybe, um... What, Ethan? I love you. Do you remember what it felt like in Chris's office last night? Because I, I remember what it felt like. Do you? Do, do I, I remember, Ethan? Are you, are you serious? Of course I remember, Ethan. I mean, making love to you, that, that's what I've, I've wanted. I love that. It, it's incredible. And why are you in here with Jared? Oh, well, th this is interesting right here. Me being the rational one. Ethan, after what happened last night, I just assumed that we were going to be together. That, that you would tell Gwen that you wanted a divorce, that we were going to get married, that, that we would be a family with Jane and little Ethan. Teresa, <laughs> I was the one that wanted to tell Gwen the truth, remember? You stopped me. The only reason I didn't say anything was because you didn't want Jared to find out. And I don't want Jared to find out if you don't end things with Gwen, so did you or did you not, Ethan? I started to and I didn't. Why not? Because I love her and I don't want to hurt her. You are never going to leave Gwen to be with me, are you, Ethan? Are you? She's my wife. And I can't. Exactly. And that is why there is no us. And there never will be. <laughs>